Welcome back to my channel, this is Akram. Currently, I'm standing in riverside of Phnom Penh, the capital of Cambodia. So this time, I'll be sharing about some interesting facts about Cambodia, just like I did in the previous video about Myanmar. So let's dive into it. Cambodia, or Kingdom of Cambodia, is located in Southeast Asia, and it's considered as the 19th largest country in the world. And the capital of this country is called Phnom Penh. And this country shares border with totally three countries, which are Laos, Thailand, and Vietnam. Cambodia has changed its name multiple times in the last 60 years due to the changes in government. From 1953 to 1970, it's called Kingdom of Cambodia. And from 1970 to 1975, it was called Khmer Republic. And from 1975 to 1979, it's called Democratic Kampucha. And from 1979 to 1989, it was called People's Republic of Kampucha. And from 1989 to 1993, it was called State of Cambodia. From 1993 up to now, it's called Kingdom of Cambodia, as the old name. The largest temple in the world is not located in India as you think. It's actually Angkor Wat in Cambodia. This temple stretches over 500 acres and more importantly, it's built in 12th century by Surya Verma II. And Angkor Wat means city of temples. Almost 2 million foreigners are visiting Angkor Wat every year. Therefore, tourism is a second economical thing in Cambodia. Cambodia's flag is the only flag in the world which features a building. I know Afghanistan flag also has, but it's not a real building. But Cambodian flag has a real building, which is actually Angkor Wat, which is just said. And if I show you hundreds of flags in front of you, you could easily point out the Cambodian flag just by looking at it due to its unique design. This country has a shocking past which happened not that long ago. During the Khmer Rouge rule, almost 2 million people were murdered from the year 1975 to 1979 because their ruler doesn't like older people, he hates them. So conclusion is, up to 63% of the population of Cambodia are actually below 30 years old. Insects are eaten throughout the country. Cambodians are renowned for cooking creepy things like crickets, ants, frogs, grasshopper, and even tarantulas. In terms of meat, pork is the first priority. It follows with beef and chicken. The largest freshwater lake in Southeast Asia is Ton Le Sap in Cambodia. The lake size changes from season to season, ranging from an area of 2,500 kilometers to 16,000 kilometers. The flow of water from the Ton Le Sap River also changes direction twice a year, making it as a natural wonder. The first thing I saw when I arrived in Phnom Penh was tuk-tuk. Tuk-tuks are waiting at the end of every street corner. And also it's the best vehicle to navigate through the streets. And also tuk-tuk was affordable and costless than taking a taxi to navigate throughout the city. US dollars is one of the national currencies Cambodia. It's not official though. Cambodian real is the national currency. But from small shops to big shop, everyone accepts US dollar in this country. But while giving the change, they might give in Cambodian real. So if you have any dollars left, you don't have to exchange it when you're heading to Cambodia. When we think about the fast food, the first food which comes to our mind is burger. Burger King, KFC, Pizza Hut, McDonald's, these are famous brands. But the fun fact is, there is no McDonald's in the whole country. Not a single branch is there. Alternatively, there are some local brands like Lucky Burger and Habit Burger. You can consume that. And also, only six branches of KFC are available in the entire country. Which is a super fun fact. The capital of Cambodia, Phnom Penh, is considered as the second expensive city in the Southeast Asia. In terms of cost of living, I wasn't talking about the cost of living as a whole because it normally includes the cost of transportation, food and cost of products and many more things included. Food consuming timings are different here than my native country. Usually the breakfast timing is from 5 a.m. to 7 a.m. and the lunch timing would be from 10.30 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. and again the dinner timing will be from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. 
This habit is not only followed in Cambodia, but also the countries which are in Southeast Asia are also following the same time schedule. Funerals are so expensive in Cambodia, though our average person's salary is 7,000 Indian rupees. But Cambodian funeral can last up to 49 days with the average expense of coming out of 7 lakhs Indian rupees. Proper funerals are incredibly important and families often have to put their entire savings to cover the cost of the funeral. While well, it might surprise you, birthdays aren't a big deal in Cambodia, especially in the rural areas. Some older people might not remember their birthdays, they only remember their birth year or their birth season. Finally, I want to end with the most shocking and terrifying fact, which is there are believed to be 4 million to 6 million landmines are active throughout the country. If you don't know what means landmines, it's an explosive weapon which is used during wars. What happens if I stomp on it accidentally? Boom! Well, I got to know many boring facts as well, but only decided to put the interesting ones. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, press the thumbs up button and smash the subscribe button. And I'll see you next video.